Well, just like that was all done, the whole leapfrog of the moonshot in response to a crisis happening in the terrestrial skies, in the heavens above us. So the Bible tells us that there's an invisible crisis happening in the skies as well. And that currently, as we now see reality, that the devil is the prince of the power of the air. That's what Ephesians chapter 2, verse 2 says. He's been wreaking havoc on the planet and in our species ever since mankind first lived on this earth. The Bible says that in the Garden of Eden, you have the enemy slithering up, sneaking up to Adam and Eve there in the perfect place, the paradise we were created to live in. We knew God, we had work to do, it was wonderful. But the enemy showed up and convinced our first parents to do what God had told them not to do, that he had warned them, if they do, it will bring a death sentence. It will bring a separation. And Romans 6, 23 says that all sin brings death. The wages of sin is death. So God enacted a plan even more complex, even more crazy, even more audacious than JFK's moonshot. He chose to leapfrog past all of the problems of sinful humanity by sending his son Jesus to the earth to die on the cross, to rise from the dead, to save us from our sins.